what is up you guys welcome back to my channel today I'm just sitting on the floor here and I am going through all of my makeup my makeup den and like my desk and drawers have been such a crazy nightmare lately anytime it's too cluttered I just get really uninspired and so we're gonna declutter this is the first installment I am gonna be decluttering all of my eye products so that includes eyeliners mascaras eyeshadows we won't be touching the palettes because I think I'll leave that for another video. I have so many eyeshadow palettes and I kind of want to show you guys every single one and why I like them, why I don't like them, why I'm tossing them for whatever reason. So that's separate. We're going to touch on everything else I related today. Keep on watching if you like these types of videos or if they give you, you know, some sort of satisfaction because I know they give me satisfaction when I'm decluttering. If you are new to my channel, my name is Anam and I create beauty and lifestyle content every week on my blog, summerxskin.com, as well as my social media channels. I'm on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, you name it, I'm on it. <laughs> and keeping this short and sweet, let's just jump right into it. I am all set. I've got my comfy PJs on, these polka dot ones, they're super comfy. And I got Lysol wipes because as I clean through every single drawer, I'm going to wipe them down. I picked up some new baskets and containers and things from Dollarama. This is my first one, which is mainly eyes, and then I've got some palettes in the back. I'm going to take everything out, dust it down, which I won't really show you guys because I don't think you want to see me cleaning my house. But we'll put them on the floor here and organize them. I'll kind of go through, you know, what I've liked, what I haven't liked, what I'm going to toss. Just to give you a little bit of context, this is how dirty it looked inside. And I've just started dumping all the products here so we can go through them together. These are essentially all the eye products that I use on an everyday basis or pretty often, including some of these single shadows that I have here, as well as like lots of eyeliners, mascaras, and I've cleaned up my baskets. Um, that I use to put everything in so they are looking nice and clean. One thing that I also like to do is as I'm tossing away some of the empties or things I need to replace, I just write them down in a notebook or some sort of to-do list so then later on I can just like fill in whatever I've tossed out. I think one basket is going to be for my brow products and maybe mascaras. One basket is going to be for all eyeliners including, you know, liquid, pencil, as well as maybe if I've got like um, pencil shadows or something and then one basket will be these eyeshadow pods that I've got. This is the Benefit Ready Set Brow Clear Brow Gel. I have used this like no other. Like it's basically all dry now. It's very little left. I love this stuff. I think this is my second tube of it. So I definitely need to replace it. And I'm going to write it down on my list here. It's one of the best brow gels I've ever used. I love this one and I love the Anastasia one, which I used for a really long time. But then I replaced it. Ah! I replaced it with this Benefit one just because I feel like it lasts longer and I also feel like it's waterproof like anytime I'm going swimming or anywhere where I'm going to be near water like a water park or something I just find this one to be much better. I'm also going to get rid of the Cabrow gel. I have used this like crazy. The pot is basically dry from inside. Um, I haven't used it in a while and I find if you don't use it on an everyday basis it does dry up. The product isn't applied the same way. I recently got the NARS Audacious Mascara, and this is a nice purple color. I think I'm going to keep this. I haven't tried it yet. I literally just got it a month ago, so I'm going to test this out and see how I like purple mascara. This is why I needed to declutter. I've got concealer with my eyes. There we go. I think we're good for mascaras and brow things. I'm sure I'm going to need to use up a lot of this uh, in the next little while so I can toss out some more mascara and just try new ones.
You guys know that the Benefit push-up liners are my favorite. I've got all four colors. I've got black, blue, green, purple. I love, love, love playing around with the different colors. I think the gel formula for these liners works so well. And I know that they're all still good, so I'm going to keep those. Got a new Maybelline black eyeliner, so I'm obviously going to open it up and put it in here. Another eye product that I really like is the Benefit Gimme Brow, which I actually recently replaced. This is a newer tube of it, so I'm just going to place that with my brow products. Next up, I've got the Lancome Grandiose eyeliners and these are also really good I love the four different colors I've got a blue pink silver and a green and I I've used them a little bit not too much this year and I know they're still good so I'm going to keep them for especially the springtime and maybe if I want to you know do some fun like Valentine's Day looks Right, I'm feeling better already, you guys. I tossed so many things. I recently got this Lee Swatier Glam Pigment in the shade Fireworks. It was part of their holiday collection. It is so beautiful. It's basically glitter in here, and it's like a really nice rose gold burgundy shade. I haven't had a chance to play with it yet, but it's so pretty. Here they are kind of organized. I've got my MAC shadows here that I want to depot and put into a palette just so I have them. It's not like a curated collection or anything. These are just colors that I've really loved over the years that I collect from MAC. Um, so I just want to have them in some sort of separate palette. I've got a few Annabelle eyeshadows and um, some of them I really want to keep. Like I really like this mustardy yellow one. I also like the purple the green and the blue, but I know that I'm not really going to use this cream color and I have it in so many other palettes already, so I'm going to get rid of that one and just hold on to these guys here. And these are my beloved Carol Baker shadows. Over the years, they've given me such amazing colors. They have a great pigment. I don't know if it's available in the States, but in Canada for sure, you'll find a Carol Baker in almost every shopping mall. Um, and they've got such a beautiful range of colors. I don't need to keep all of them as beautiful as they are. I feel like I have some of these colors already, so I'm separating the ones that I know I would never really use and then keeping the ones that I really like. Like, see what I mean? Both of these peach shades are so, so similar. One is a bit more rose goldy, one is more peachy orange, so definitely keeping the rose goldy one. And I'll put this one here. All of these shades. Bye shadows. Bye. I'll miss you guys. I have a Kiss Strip Lash Adhesive um, Glue that I use for my lashes. I'm just gonna keep that maybe in the mascara with the mascaras. And there we have it. I'm done. Woohoo! Wow, I can't believe how much better it already looks. I've just got some shadows that I really, really wanted to keep. I've got my MAC shadows here, which you guys know I need to depot and put into a palette, so I've just separated them for now. I've got all my brow tools as well as mascaras here, and just the remaining eyeliners and eyeshadow primers and just like tools here. Yes, we are on our way to... A smooth declutter once I remove the Mac shadows from here I'm gonna put some palettes in here as well so those are just temporarily temporarily there for now thank you so much for watching this video I hope you guys enjoyed watching me declutter my eye makeup <laughs> I found it super soothing and relaxing while I was going through every single item literally every single thing and tossing out what I didn't need anymore and I'm excited to replace it with a lot of new things this year cuz you know new year new makeup right <laughs> don't forget to give me a a huge thumbs up I would love that and subscribe if you haven't already and join my YouTube fam thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time Mwah! bye